Hello everybody, welcome back once again to the Final Fantasy X HD Remaster. Uh, so this one we are starting out on our way back down to Besaid, and um, we're going to take on Dark Veil 4. Uh, very easy fight, I, I already, you know, I'm all, I'm all statted up, and so uh, this ends up being, you know, extremely, extremely easy. Um, you know, if you're if you're not, uh, might it might be a little bit more of a challenge. Let's see if there's some dialogue here. I can't remember. Uh, yeah, let's do that. All right, so, all right, so uh, Dark Veil 4 is actually just really, really easy. Uh, there's, you know, I, I can't really even say much about the strategy. So it's got uh, 800,000 HP, you know, meaning that if you could, if, like me, you've already taken down, like, you know, Nemesis, this is going to be an absolute joke. But uh, the only thing that I really want to bring up with uh, Dark Veil 4 here is, uh, for one thing, you know, if you manage to fill up its, uh, you know, limit gauge, uh, it'll do about 50k to all of your characters, so uh, if you can't survive that, then summon an Aeon in and uh, and just block it. Um, so again, that's, that's honestly the only thing I really have to say about uh, about defeating this Aeon. I like that they recycle that clip of stay away from the summoner and you're a bad man from the very beginning of the game. Um, but anyways, uh, really, uh, honestly, I think that the best rewards from Dark Veil 4 is uh, it would be either break HP limit or or a combination of break HP limit and ribbon on the armor. Uh, you don't want to get any real weapons from here unless you get really, really lucky and get the break uh, damage limit. But um, all right, that is going to be it for this one. As always, hope the guide was helpful and hope you join me for more videos. Thanks for watching.